Hey, what up? This is Maxi, and this time we're going to talk about signs someone likes you. for watching this time we're going to have it about signs someone likes you and I actually so badly to blame to those kind of things too I just realized that I actually do that all the time to people I really really like it can be in a friendship as well it's a kind of relationship but anyway we're going to have it about those eight signs and I'm really excited to share with you guys so let's go one try to stay in touch with you or want to hang around with you all the time if you want to stay in touch with someone what I actually love the most because I just want to talk to people I do not see but that's not better but this is the kind of way you say ah I do care about you how is your life going do you want to share excitement or do you want to share your sadness I don't know want to stay in touch with each other is it's a cool way for me I write letters because I just like to be personal and out of the box not like the texting all the time without emotions because when you see someone writing you see like how they felt by writing it down and um, yeah so to stay in touch is not a bad thing at all it's it's a good thing and I want to hang around with you all the time because someone really likes you and just want to have fun with you and just want to do some fun things to make memories out of it but I'm just a person who likes to stay in touch and try everything to stay in touch and maybe it's too much but it's just the way I am so don't really worry about it I just love to talk to you that's just me let's go to two two body language and body language you can see different ways like mirroring and reacting and the mirroring part is what I want to tell you now it's when you hang around with someone all the time you really like and you're going to do copy some little things I do it most of the time with words I, I do not realize until I say the same thing and it's like where did I actually got it from and then I realize ah yeah so when you're mirroring someone like you're sitting with your legs crossed because I can't do it because I have to do it hard this way but if you're sitting with your legs crossed and someone's going to do that as well when you're mirroring each other then you realize or someone likes you or you like someone you just mirrored and that is really funny that's just the way things work it actually is also when you have your legs crossed and your knee is pointing to someone you like that's a sign that you're someone like if you do it like this way I actually never knew that and I'm sorry if I point my knee on the other side but when I do that not because I do not like you but because my knees are hurting like sitting this way all the time like ah, oh, let's do it this way and then let's go back that way but not the fact that I do not like you I I'm just a person I don't know I didn't knew those kind of things until I was figuring it out and the eyebrows you know these kind of things and then if you do that to someone then you're really interested in someone like what they're telling and really kind of way I really like you and this is really funny and I know someone who does that a lot, but that's, that's really cool to know. So, if you do this, and I'm talking to you, then you know I really like you. Let's go to three. Number three. Number three. Laughing. Laughing is the most funniest thing in the world. Because when you just have so much fun, you laugh your ass off. You can't stop laughing anymore. And your tears are rolling down your cheeks. And you just have so much fun. Those are the amazing memories. And I have a lot of pictures actually in my room. That remember me about those kind of moments. So it really makes me oh, so happy. A drinking game. So let's do a drinking game. And you're sitting there. And someone starts laughing. What are you doing? Do you start laughing too? Or check you out someone you really like. How he, she is reacting. Does she not react like this is not funny? But what is this? Then I'm like, it's not funny. It's not funny. Although I have to laugh, does not like it. That's just what you do. But if someone laughs like really loud, you like, and it even go louder because you want that someone to hear you laugh as well because you do like it as well. That is just so. 
that's when you like someone and that is just happening that is just a fact a really a fact so that was number three let's go to four four when someone gets nervous around you and you can realize that by someone is watching you all the time but does not know what to say I'm so much to blame to this as well. Want to hang around with you all the time and when you around them actually do nothing. I, I'm, I'm a really nervous person from natural and I'm actually like that when I really really like someone. Sometimes I can get in this mode like I want to do nothing but I don't know what to say because I'm so nervous. So I just get hot inside, sweaty hands and I'm like What should I do now? That, that is just me and I know a lot of more people are like that. When you get nervous around someone, please do not feel embarrassed at all. It is a sign you really like someone. And if you see someone gets nervous because of you, it's such a good compliment. But if I see that in the future, because I never knew it actually, I knew I was doing it, but I was never thinking about the fact someone else could have it too, because I do not feel like some people are looking up to me because I look up to people so I don't realize it can be with me as well if I see that I will try to chill them down and feel them more relaxed and I'm your friend why should you be nervous around me just chill down have some fun drink some dance laugh go crazy that's my advice let's go to five five compliments amazing compliments how much fun is it to get that and how much fun is it to give it? I really like to give compliments because it makes someone feel really good about itself. And I do not give compliments if it is not true. So I'm a really honest person. If it is not true, I'm not giving you a compliment about that. I only give a compliment about things you really can and really should deserve. So if I give you a compliment about you're such a hard worker, you earn this vacation, um, you're a really good singer, you're a really good artist, I really give those compliments because I mean it out of my heart and I want to give you a good feeling about yourself because you're just an amazing person and that's why I really like you. You should not see it as an attack. Josh, you give me compliments. Is this true or not? Promise you, out of my heart, if I give you a compliment, then is it for real. So, and, and to give you a boost. When you need a boost, like you're such a hard worker, yes you can. That is a compliment. I believe in you because I really believe in you. So never feel it as an attack. Really never ever. Because I really give you a compliment out of my heart. And if someone give my, gives me a compliment, I'm like, yeah! But is it true? I should trust people if that's true. So I'm really happy when people give me compliments. And I can tell I'm not the best person to react to those compliments. I say, thanks. But inside, there's like a whole party going on everywhere, the decoration going. That's inside my mind. But then there is thanks, and like the, blo uh, I don't know, blushing smiley. And I I'm not good in, in taking compliments, but I will work on it. I, I promise you. But I really mean it. Thank you so much. I really like when you guys give me compliments. It gives me such a good feeling. Let's go to six. Six, the hit game. And you're like, what? The hit game? What are you talking? hit game i mean like when you was a little child i as a girl and we had like boyfriends as well so if you try to hit each other and i don't know that's a kind of way what you can do is like like for fun yeah try to smash each other like boof and then you're trying to hide and boof and then those kind of things and I actually really love it so much I don't know why it's just inside of me that really loves it so much to scare the crap out to my friends so to make them scared yeah, it is just so much fun but I really like you when I do it I don't know to trigger them to run after me I don't know why it just just made me so it gives an adrenaline kick and I just like it so much when I hit you with something and you run after me, I have just the time of my life because I love so much to make fun of my friends and not in a bad way, but like 
sit and buy the mattress and then Wah! I just love it so much and the reaction is always so funny sorry my friends when I do this to you but I really like to scare you it's not really fair but I really love it so much and when you have eyes once with BB with a towel we were hitting each other really f I mean yeah, just so much fun <laughs> uh, uh, yeah that, that is just a thing you you love to 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 be active and the kind of messed up things to hit each other it can be in such a nice way and there was never ever violence in it it was just like the friends the craziness and oh, it was just so much fun let's go to seven what? seven someone is not scared to touch you if you really like a person like my bubble my bubble then you're really scared that someone touch you and if she does do this Bubble just popped. With friends, there is no bubble. This, there is no bubble. You can do whatever you want, and even more when you're drunk. I really like to hit someone. I don't know why. Or maybe I want just to try my strength out. But okay, you, you, you're not scared to touch someone, or when someone is said you're not scared to touch the hand. That's a sign that someone really likes you. And um, yeah, that is just a fact. So if someone touch you and you're not mad about it or just feel comfortable with it, that's a really good friend. And then you know if it's the other way around, it's the same. So see it as a good thing. Touching like, go, hurry up. Hug touching or you, you know what I mean. No, not that. Yeah, let's go further. Let's go to number eight. Eight, remembering details. When you're remembering details, like really, really little details like clothes or what someone was doing or what the music was on they never know girl boy you really like me they know that because they remember those kind of things and when it was like a useless day because they do not like you when you're with someone you really like you remember those kind of things because you don't want to forget the things with them you really like but if you do not like someone then it's like it's not useless but it's like the person you don't want to hang around with I do not remember those kind of things but when I was someone it's really my friend and really my heart is filled with them then I'm like remembering almost everything and that's just shows kind of things I can remember for example I can remember for example that while we were playing the Busu game in Africa she was wearing a shirt with elephants on it that when I was partying with one of my friends who likes gin and tonic uh, that she was wearing a cap with the day at the pub the day she left out of Africa was wearing like this long thing in grey that the one was Germany she was wearing brown wooden earrings like really thick not normal like a cool uh, African style with a friend of mine, really good friend of mine, that she bought an Apple watch and that she was really excited because that day would the watch come. She was wearing, when she caught me from Joburg, she was wearing pullover, white blues under it, and she had a package with cake in it. And she asked me if I wanted it, and I was like, mm -hmm. But those kind of things I remember. So those are the kind of things that are signs to you or to someone else you really like them. And please do not feel scared about them. Only where you do not like the person like, whoa dude, this is way too much. I don't know, just try to be nice. That's my thing I want to share with you guys. I hope you liked the movie, put the thumbs up. If you don't want to put the thumbs up, you don't need to, but it will be lots of fun because I can see now how much people like this video. And uh, I will do more of these kind of things. It will be on a Wednesday because it's an extra thing. Yeah, if you like eyes open now, like mind blowing, like whoa, someone likes me and I like to do amazing. That's just what I want you to happen because it's just sometimes very hard to realize you like someone and that person does not like you. See ya, peace out. How much fun is it to realize someone really likes you too? I hope you are made today and if not, 
try to check other movies on YouTube because there are a lot of amazing movies. So have loads of fun today and I hope to see you back next time.